Hey everyone, today I'm checking out Siam Park in Tenerife. It's a huge water park, water theme park. Let's check it out and see what it's all about. I've never been here before. Look at the queue to get in. That is crazy. This is the queue to get a locker. Probably be like 10, 15 minutes. But yeah, this is where you go by the souvenirs to get your locker key. The main Lazy River entrance. Got all the gyros there. That's pretty good. You got like a children's splash park there. It's quite cool. That is huge. You got like load of kids slides there. Smaller ones. That's probably really good for kids. Got load of sun beds around as well. I don't think we'll be allowed to uh, test on water slides because, uh, yeah, we're not children. So once you come down here, that was where the kids' splash park was. You get to the first ride here. That is Naga Racer, and it's one of the ones where you have a mat, and you come down a wavy bit there. And Adam's going to come down now, so I'll form that for you guys. The theme in here is amazing. You've got like a dragon there. You've got all the nice plants there. Just look at this. Absolutely lovely. Looks really cool. It's a bit wet, you don't look happy. Judging by Adam's reaction, he didn't look happy on that. Uh, we'll get his thoughts on that when he comes off. You didn't look happy. Huh? You didn't look happy at the end. <laughs> How was it? I breathed in with the water. Is it good? <coughs> a little bit wet. Out of 10? Uh, seven. Seven? That's all right. Nice little quick slide, you That's didn't have to I wait long. I'd... You only have to wait about 30 seconds. 30 seconds for that, not too bad. So here's like the main first big ones with the uh, Magaigos. So let me show you them. Adam should be coming out one of these. Um, I'm pretty sure these are the jungle snakes. Um, I think the dragon is that one as it's by there. So. That's, like, uh, that's what I'm assuming. Um, but yeah, there's four slides here. Um, I think Adam will come out one of these, possibly. Here we go. Long leg cam. Let's go. Jesus. Oh, God. Look at the legs, guys. Ah, shit. Oh, oh my butt. I'm backwards. What the? So I've just gone down to the middle of the park and then there's the Tower of Power. Look at the size of that. Adam's going on it. Um, you can't use a GoPro though, so I'll just be filming off the ride. Um, but yeah, the height of that is crazy. It's almost like a vertical drop. Jeez! This is sick. Oh, So I'm just going up to the viewing platform of the Tower of Power. You got, um, that's where you come out down there, the splash zone. And then yeah, you got this little platform up here where you can view the people coming down and then they come down there. Under there is an aquarium, because so you go through the aquarium. But I'll show you also on the Lazy River later, you go through there as well. Just look at the theme in here, look at that dragon, the detail on that. It's a lovely park, so you've got all the trees everywhere and you can't actually see any of the rides from the road or outside the park. It's really cool, the way it's done. It's a bit like Disneyland, like, you cannot see this huge tower when you're like out of the park, which is really cool. Um, but yeah, just waiting for Adam to come down now. Um, yeah, it's probably like 15, 20 minute wait. So Adam's just come down. They made him take his top off and he's held, held, had to hold it and it's got absolutely drenched. So yeah, look at that. 
crazy. Crazy. Here we go, guys. Oh, oh Jesus! We got a lot of these splash little parks around. Adam's gonna demonstrate it. One out of ten, not very fun. But yeah, you got literally rides everywhere. It's hard to film every ride because there's so many and you don't really, you just see the bottom of them where they come out. So yeah. sometimes you don't know where you actually go to queue up for it. Like we've seen a ride we want to do, but we've just seen a bit of the track of it. We don't know where you queue. When you see a ride, you sometimes don't know uh, where it is. How was Tower of Power? Terrifying. It's terrifying. It threw me off before I even got ready. It's like old t-shirts. So I was like crunching it to be cut. It just threw me off. Out of 10? Uh, nine. Nine out of 10. This is quite cool here. You've got a waterfall and you've got like these stepping stones to get across. That's quite cool. Magazi River. I got the GoPro, I haven't turned it on though. Um, I don't know where. Oh, he's over there. <laughs> but yeah. Yeah. To be fair, I'm not moving this time and I'm moving. Um, but yeah, it's probably one of the only ones I can actually film. Um, but we'll turn left and go up the rapid bit in a bit. So cool just to sit here and chill. Because you don't even have to move or anything, you just lay back the current will take you because some lazy rivers it's a bit dodgy it's like um it doesn't always take you but this one it takes you actually quite well and it's very very well themed you got all the lovely trees here you've got waterfalls water jets there's always something to look at on this very lazy river it's really cool really nice some water jets here It's a bit queued on the Gazy River. <laughs> Look at it. I'd do this because it helps. We get you at stacks like the M25 here. Going up the conveyor belt. It's the coolest Gazy River I've been on, right? It's got a lift hill. Never seen that ever before. Um, but yeah, just going up all under the trees, and it's pretty sick. We're about to get to the top of the lift hill. We're at the top. It's not like a straight drop though. You go around another oh, lazy river bit. Yesterday. We're going down. Sorry if it's a bit shaky, I'm holding one hand and I'm trying to hold on to the, the boat as well. He's got a good technique, he like throws you around and then pushes you off with his bum, which is very skill. Look, ready? Look at the skill. So I've just ordered French fries, three euros, and it's done already. That was about a two second wait. So I've just got chips from a bar, three euros. Um, I haven't had them yet, they look all right. Not a bad price, three euros, really. So I have to keep doing a lot of cuts on this because there's so much copyrighted music playing uh, that I have to keep cutting out. There's speakers everywhere. Um, but yeah, I got three euro chips and more copyrighted music is playing now. That's cool. This is where he slips. Lovely though, it's absolutely beautiful here with all the trees, all the fountains, it's really nice. So the Lazy River was good, uh, we went off in the cross section where you went down the rapids bit but it was very busy, very queued. Uh, we'll probably wait in about 5, 10, maybe even 15 minutes to be fair. Um, but yeah, yeah, a guy got stuck, um, so we had to evacuate 
um, the ride and then it all like held up and congested and then we weren't moving. Adelph and all the ladies like catch up to our family, we were pushing them along. But yeah, apart from that, it was all good. Um, I, I hurt my ankle. We're going to head to, oh, is it the wave machine pool now? Yeah, Adam's going to do the wave machine pool. Um, so I can just show you that uh, from out of it. But we did it the other day. It is a big wave to be fair near the front. It's it just like, a letdown. It's a bit of a letdown because it's one big wave and then a lot of little waves and then you're waiting. You wait like three minutes between three minutes each one. Another big wave and then... So yeah, it's, it's, it could it's be better fun. if it was continuous but the fact continuous you have to wait massive... yeah but you're waiting three minutes for abs with absolutely nothing that's the only thing but i'll show you that when we get down there so this is the siam beach with the wave pool as you can see the weather is it's been like this the whole day if you see my holiday yeah. vlog which would have been posted before this you would see how bad the weather's been all holiday it's been gray cloudy every single day but it's sunny to start off with and then all of a sudden yeah but here's Siam Beach, so you got all the sun lounges, deck chairs, you got bars, restaurants there. And then you got the big pool here with the huge wave machine. I'll get some shots. But yeah, you know when it goes because like water squirts out them towers. I'll get that in a video to show you. It's very cool. But yeah, this is huge, this uh, the water. This water is lovely and warm. It is really really nice it's weird because all the uh, water slides are either freezing cold or really warm water the lazy river was lukewarm water this is warm water um so yeah it's really weird that it's either freezing cold or warm um yeah because some water slides are either freezing or really warm so but they're okay because like you're not really in them like mainly like you're sitting in the dinghy boats um but yeah i'll get a shot of the wave machine when it comes on. I don't know how often this goes off. I've just had the clip going for four minutes and it's not been off. And we were here about two minutes before that and hadn't gone off. So it's been five at least. Um, so yeah, I don't know how often the wave machine goes off. So a lot of people down there waiting for it. Um, but yeah, it hasn't uh, gone off yet. I might as well do a review of them chips whilst I'm waiting here. Uh, yeah, so they were three euros. Uh, they were really warm, really nice. Um, there wasn't loads of them to be fair. I'd say they're more for children, um, but it didn't state that anywhere. Uh, but yeah, for three euros, pretty decent. Considering you're at a big like water theme park um, place, um, three euros really isn't that bad for food. If you're thinking of UK theme park, chips there are probably near a four or five pounds where three euros isn't bad at all really. So yeah, decent food. Um, I don't know if I'll try a burger, depends how long we're here for because obviously we're staying at an all-inclusive resort, so we get all the food for free. So we don't really like to go out and spend money when we get food for free. Um, but yeah, chips are pretty decent. And it's been about seven minutes now, and the wave machine has not gone off. Um, so yeah, I don't know if there's a problem or if it's meant to be that long. Also, if you're thinking about coming here, a locker is required. Um, you definitely do need a locker just to store your stuff, to keep your stuff safe. So every lock you purchase comes with a wristband and the key, and it just securely goes around your wrist. Um, the lockers, a small one is seven pounds, and the large one is 10 pounds. But for seven pounds, the small one, um, we've managed to fit both our pairs of shoes in, both our clothes, both our bags, and there's still a bit of room. So a small locker for two people is absolutely fine. If you're a family of three or four, you'd want a big locker. A small locker is fine if there's just the two of you. The locker is seven euros for a small, and obviously you don't get the money back. Uh, you pay the seven euros, you get the given the key, and then at the end, you drop the key in a little box at the reception um, where you buy the locker. And there's so many lockers. I think there's at least three or four locker locations around the park as well. That was it, 20 minutes for that. So that was a 30 second clip and that was a 20 minute wait for that. Dead on 20 minutes. Yeah, I uh, don't think that was worth it. If it's one every 20 minutes, that's crazy. Um, but yeah, the amount of people that ran for that, that was crazy. And there was what, one big wave and then three small ones. 
Um, yeah, not not brilliant if that was one every 20 minutes. It was a technical fault, that's why it took 20 minutes. It's just gone off again, it's been about two minutes now. So yeah, it must be fixed. People are absolutely getting sick. You get so you came up to my knees from here. Crazy. Okay. You look a bit cold and wet. It caught me off guard completely. I got kicked in the back. Did you? Yeah, look, it comes all the way up to your knees at the bottom, look. Well, I So I've come to the end of the day at Scion Park. It was a great day. Definitely the best water park I've ever been to. I can see why it's definitely rated the best theme park in the world. So I think it's like the seventh year running. An awesome day. I really did enjoy it. Really great water slide. The Lazy River is really cool. I love how they've got the little rapids bit off the side. That's a really cool feature. Really good theming all round. Not a bad price to come here either. So if you come to Tenerife, make sure to definitely come and check out Scion Park. If you did like the video, make sure to hit that like button. Make sure to comment down below and hit the subscribe button so you don't miss the video. Thanks for watching.